Yo guys, I'm Yellow, a Norwegian hardcore PC gamer, and today I figured that we should go through the replay mode that you're watching me play at right here, in which we are going to go through not just highlights, but it's gonna be about how the, it works, and all the flaws that it have. Because it, hi, the highlight mode in Counter-Strike, it just got so many fucking flaws, and I know all of them, because I'm the one that uses this mode the most, so let's go through all of them. Keep in mind also, by the way, that if you watch enough of your highlight replays, and you do similar plays, they will look the same, and by the same I mean you will get the same same bugs, which is annoying. So let's start then with the most annoying and most recent one. It will be about the fade in and fade out, which is not in this highlight replay because this was recorded before the R8 got introduced. So enjoy. I thoroughly am because I love this more. But the bl black fade in and fade out is very annoying because it got this jittery fucking flicker bullshit towards itself. I don't know who made it, but they did a terrible job and they should retune it and may maybe make it so that it works for people that got a 120 hertz uh, PC, for example. Uh, or maybe it should just be more even because it flickers when I watch it I mean, it's horrible at 144 frames per second at Hertz uh, even if it still looked terrible at 60 uh, But anyways the point though is that that should not happen I, I don't understand how they could push out something so terrible. So there's that anyways Let's move on then to the smokes because those are also pretty uh, obviously annoying So when you're watching me play in a lot of scenarios, but not a that many in the new version though um, The smoke will be desynced so in these older ones it could be desynced up a lot to like two to four seconds, which made it so that I would have gunfights with people, and we were apparently by viewers both cheating or just me, even though again the viewer disregarded the opponent hitting me. But in reality, the smoke was actually desynced, so yeah, we actually both saw each other at the same time. Now, in reality, that is something that only happens because of the speed up and speed down, or something related which is similar in the fade in and fade out version that we got right now. However, what I want to point out in that avenue is that it should be pretty simple for Val to fix if they cared, but I, I get just I just guess they don't. Um, and at that, this will never happen ever if you are playing off a game from Overwatch, for example, and somebody are cheating or you're suspecting them. Uh, the smoke will never desynchronize in that environment because it's uh, do n there's no speed up or down essentially, which is what trigger and activates that fucking annoying smoke de um, desync per se. So yeah, keep that in mind. That is essentially how it works, and you'll never find it to uh, have you at fault unless you do something other crazy kind of stuff. But I won't get into that. Uh, you know, a bug talk, I guess you could say. But anyways, aside from that, uh, there are other things that are annoying in this avenue, and that is actually the desync of everything that happens in terms of your hit registration uh, itself. Now, by default, uh, every single demo file that you ever, will ever come across of you playing, of professionals playing, um, anything really, it will always be a little bit desynced. Now, the thing about this is that that is just how the replay works, um, unless I think uh, you record your own kind of sort of uh, POV, which thus means that there will still be some desynchronization, but it will never be as it was when you played. Normally, because of how headshots appear after they happen when you shoot and play, um, but in the replay, they, they might be so desynced, they, they can happen before you actually take the shot, which is why stuff look dried out and horrible. However, there are two or three ways of making it worse, which is fucking insane. So, <laughs> let's go through those then, shall we? Um, okay, so let's say that your PC isn't that good. Now, things are going to look uh, even more desynced. So let's say that you only play at 60 FPS. Stuff are going to look more desynced to you and I'm not kidding, um, if you're playing at least, not if you're watching a, a footage, for example. But it's gonna get more desync because your graphics card is literally showing what happens in the game by delay because that is how the game works or the game um, coding per se. In which, if you then apply all of your graphics, you'll find the game to be even more sluggish. But only if your frame rate is like never... Uh, okay, how do I explain this the very best? If your PC is a fucking monster, you're not gonna notice it at all because your computer is going to be able to get through all that data instantly. However, there's going to be more and more and more noticeable delay for pieces that are in between in terms of their specs or if they're really bad or low, which is the case with my PC, go figure. My PC is just some FX8350 overclocked uh, stuff. It's getting really old, I reckon, and the graphics card is 7970. Uh, the rest doesn't really matter too much because it's an AMD-based trig. I can thoroughly see that, like, the more low that I put on this machine, the more delay you find in any respect. Everything from the hit reg of what my graphics card is trying to render to what actually happens when I play or if I for example try to record uh, which is the last thing by the way if you play max graphics and you record 
and you're watching a replay, that causes the most amount of delay on any replay ever, and it looks absolutely fucking insane. Which is why I'm like, you know what, I'm just gonna take this punch right to the chest, because if people think I'm cheating, and I know I'm not cheating, and I know that I got legitimately over 10,000 hours of practice first person shooting gaming, because I find it to be fun, go figure, some people like bowling, some people like, you know, racer cars, I like Counter-Strike or just shooter games in general, there we go, you know, obviously I'm skilled, but if the replay and my PC and my conditions fuck me over, well, uh, that's on value in my book and not really me, even though again, I guess it's still on me, but you, you probably get the point by now, in which, as I mentioned, even though again it's probably gonna be difficult for people with a good PC to simulate this, you can simulate this, and it's annoying, and hopefully some of it will get fixed in the future. Anyways, I won't really harp too much on that, hopefully people enjoy this video, these are still uh, the most current problems with the highlight replay and demo files in general, I've made a similar video about this in the past, I might remove that eventually, because this one is more recent and cover everything that I said in that one I think, and from there on out, enjoy the replays and gameplays, I will have one video made uh, rather shortly about cheating by the way, so stay tuned for that, you lusty potato heads, or just or epic beasts, I don't know, you you take the pick of what you want to be. Here to relate the videos if you want to get better at Counter-Strike, unless you're good from before, good on you. Uh, thanks for the support on Patreon, uh, please do follow me on Twitter, Facebook and Twitch. Thanks for watching, thanks for the support, have a nice day, and don't get beastified when you play.